Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So in last week's beta channel build for the insiders that rolled out on Friday, which was 22635.4945, over and above a couple of minor improvements, Microsoft focused quite a bit on fixing some File Explorer issues in this latest beta channel build. And I thought I'd just focus on the File Explorer for the purpose of today's video because whenever the File Explorer does get improvements, I always think that is a nice move in the right direction because the File Explorer, in my personal opinion, is not up to par yet in Windows 11. Now, first of all, there are five fixes that have rolled out where the first is Microsoft said they did more work to improve the performance of extracting zip files in File Explorer, particularly when you're unzipping a large number of small files. So I think that's a nice move. And then they fixed a couple of issues, they say, impacting File Explorer reliability for insiders. And then the third fix was an issue when opening File Explorer from the command line would result in their address bar being empty and not displaying the current path. And then the fourth fix fixes an issue where you couldn't select multiple files in the recommended section of home by holding shift and clicking the files. Now, over and above those four fixes, the big one with this is that Microsoft says they fixed an issue causing the see more menu in the command bar to open in the wrong direction for some resolutions. Now, this has been plaguing a lot of users in the stable version and also in the insider channels of Windows 11 for quite some time. And I have posted a whole video on this. And I have seen a couple of comments on the channel where viewers have said this has been fixed uh, in their region, not in my region. And I know there are a good couple of other regions where this is still an issue. And I don't know why Microsoft is taking so long to actually sort this upside down menu out. It still works. If you minimize it, you can still get to all the options, but it's just heading in the wrong way. And of course, if you are full screen, it gets cut off, as I mentioned previously. Now, this is in the beta channel. So hopefully now that it's in beta channel, dev channel, some users in the stable version have um, received the fix for this issue. Hopefully, that will be sorted out sooner than later now um, in the stable version with our next optional update that's rolling out over the next couple of days. And although it's good to see that Microsoft is working on this in the Insider program, I just don't understand why it's taken them so long to actually roll this fix out to the stable version. And they say it is opening in the wrong direction for some resolutions. So maybe it's pertaining to how your screen is set up or your graphics are set up. But nonetheless, I think that should be fixed because that obviously is a silly, annoying bug where it opens in the wrong direction. And as mentioned, that was the latest beta channel build, not to be confused with the dev and beta build I've just posted on because beta channel is also open to 24H2 as an optional update. This is just for um, beta channel insiders still running 23H2. So this will be for the 23H2 version of Windows 11. So just keep that in mind. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.